Hi, I'm Joe Caracci. I'm the Director of Public Works here in the Village of Bensonville. Uh, we are here today to uh, perform a little Public Works open house for our residents here in Bensonville. Frank Colombo, Superintendent of Operations here at the Department of Public Works. Today is our open house, see a little bit behind the scenes of each division. We've got our utilities division, they're going to show you the water main breaks, the process of that, uh, how your water goes on and off and where it goes all through town. Our street division, filling potholes, making sure our street lights and street signs are properly installed, as well as giving you a tour on the snow plow. Make sure you guys see what we see. Hi, I'm the I'm Chris Duza. I'm the Fleet and Facilities Supervisor here at Public Works in Bensonville. Um, we have a team of five individuals, three facility technicians and two mechanics and we maintain about 90 trucks, cars in the fleet, and we have uh, a number of buildings, including some new ones this year we've adopted, the ice rings and, and Redmond Park. And we pretty much, uh, we maintain the investment that's made that the village has put in for vehicles and buildings to ensure that they get the most use out of them in the time frame that they're supposed to. Um, great bunch of guys, great bunch of people to work with and work for. Um, and here we are at Public Works Day today, helping everybody understand all that we do. Hi, I'm Greg. I'm with the, uh, the Fleet Department for the Village of Bensonville. Um, here in our fleet, we, I maintain, or I should say me and another mechanic, we maintain over 100 pieces of equipment, um, anything from lawnmowers to chainsaws to crane trucks to <laughs> antique fire vehicles and stuff like that. So. Uh, and there's really nothing that stops us and stuff like that. We try to keep the village moving and that's that. <laughs> hey, good morning. I'm Jeff Masco. I'm the village engineer and we're out here at the Public Works Open House talking about the uh, responsibilities of the engineering division here at Public Works. One of the many things we do is uh, implement our capital improvement program across the course of the summer. So all the road construction projects, maintenance projects on all the village assets are handled in the engineering department. So we're out here today showcasing some of the things that we do, some of our projects that we have going on this summer, and we've also brought out some of the tools we use, a GPS collection system and a total station uh, for collecting village assets and doing surveying and things like that in the village. And we have our forestry division. We're going to tell you all about our very important urban forest and how we're very passionate about that and everything they do to make sure it's safe and hazard free for all of you. This is our truck for televising. Uh, we check all our sanitary and uh, storm mains. Um, we televise it, we record it, we check for cracks, anything, um, anything broken, if anything's uh, obstructing flow, like roots or steel or maybe even animals. Uh, I found raccoons in storms before, uh, found mice. Uh, haven't found any Ninja Turtles yet, but <laughs> still on a mission for it. But uh, yes, we got video inside. We got the laptop for where I use it uh, and document everything and put it into our database. On the other side right here, we have our rover. Our rover goes into the, all the pipes and mains. I have a demonstration for all the people here. Just like a little tiny RC car. Comes right on the other side. 
simply as that, I, that's all we do here. We check everybody's taps and connections to their houses. We uh, make sure the connections to our main is, uh, is pure and is not broken, not separated, not, uh, not like an offset or anything like that. Other than that, uh, it's pretty simple. It's, a lot of kids come here and they like to play with it. They think it's a little robot car, a little tight RC car. And I let them play with the, the crawler itself. All right, as you saw with the televising unit, I have to crawl into the mains and all the pipes in town and check out the and video and record all of them. So to do that, to get through the pipes, we have a uh, sewer jetter. This cleans all the pipes before I go in there so I can get in there and have access and do all the uh, accurate documentation. So it's just like that router you had inside your house, but this uses water instead of a cable. Our jet head's right here. That sprays and cleans and pulls back all the dirt. While that pulls back all the dirt, this is our vac unit. This sucks out all of the debris and material that might be found in, in these pipes, which is like rock, sand, uh, roots. Uh, pretty much that's what we find in our mains right there. Those, those, those are main components. Uh, we have a big, large debris tank on it. Holds all the uh, debris that we pull out of the sanitary main. 1,500 gallons of water on each, each side of the truck. She runs about 1,200 PSI on pressure. So she's got a lot of power, a lot more than you have to see at your house. <laughs> If you weren't able to come this year, hope you can uh, come join us in the future. Thanks.